Hello friends, my name is Jabhishek and today in this video I am going to show you how to do mathematical calculations in MS PowerPoint. So friends, I have a table in MS PowerPoint and I am working on this table. Let's assume that you have a big data. So if you want to give any mathematical calculations formula here, this doesn't work here. So you just have to follow the method that I am going to follow here. You have to copy the table here because you have created already a good table and uh, you have also filled a good color in MS PowerPoint. So this is actually in Hindi language. My presentation is for Hindi language, but I am making this video in English so that uh, my English viewers can assume this and uh, can learn this. And you have to copy this and you have to open MS Excel then and here you have to paste here and let's uh, let's reduce the table size so that you can observe all this so friends the work is done now you have to save this file on your computer like i am saving this by digital software on desktop or uh, anywhere you can so actually you have not to delete this file until your presentation uh, is on work if you want to reflect these data on your uh, ms powerpoint then you have to keep this excel file on your computer because you have to do is you have to copy this from here and have to go to your ms powerpoint again and then you have to select a new slide here and you have to click on paste special and then paste the link and then click on ok then you can see that the table is inserted now and you can delete the behind data and you can uh, resize it like you can increase the size of this table so you can just uh, make duplicate of the prior one like this and you can see that there is no sum or no mathematical calculations here like this so if you want to calculate these data you have to go to excel and then give here some calculation or some function and then select the select the uh, areas then click enter or press enter you can see that 1.1 is written here the resultant like here is minus sign you you have to consider while calculating this so you have to just uh, re-go to your powerpoint you can see that the sum calculation has done now and here it's a uh, blank so this is actually a link to that MS, ms excel file that i have created here and i have pasted the link of uh, this table on my ms powerpoint so you can do you can do this and uh, if you are working on your computer and you, if you are presenting your uh, data then you have to keep in mind that you have uh, you have not to delete that excel file because if that excel file deletes this data will be vanished away so this is the way how you can do huge calculations on your ms powerpoint or your presentation without using any calculator or anything or any stuff hope this video is useful for you guys thank you